The Dragon's Wrath Chapter 1 The Resurgence Darkness crept through the streets of Boston like an insidious disease, slithering through the narrow alleys and seeping into every crack and crevice. The rain poured down in relentless sheets, bathing the city in a cold, soul-soaking drizzle that mirrored the concerns of Commissioner Marshall Hall. In his office, the only source of light came from the dim glow of his desk lamp, casting long shadows that danced ominously across the walls. The Scarlet Dragon Crime Syndicate had re-emerged, like a phoenix rising from the ashes of its own demise. It had been years since their last display of power, but now, they were back, and their presence was felt in every corner of the city. Marshall knew that this time, the Scarlet Dragon was merely seeking to establish control they aimed to dominate. In this cauldron of fear and uncertainty, there was one woman who refused to be consumed by the darkness. Her name was Satchel Drummond, a formidable detective with sharp hazel eyes that gleamed with a resilient fire. She had faced countless criminals before, but the Scarlet Dragon was on a different level entirely. The mere mention of their name sent shivers down the spine of even the most seasoned officers. Commissioner Hall beckoned Satchel into his office, his weathered face etched with lines of worry. Sack Hell, sit down. He said, gesturing to the worn chair opposite him. We've got a problem, a big one. The Scarlet Dragon has resurfaced, and they're more dangerous than ever. Satchel's gaze remained fixed on her superior. As she took her seat, the commissioner was a man who had seen it all, and if his concern ran deep then there was no doubt that they were facing an enemy of unimaginable power. Still, Satchel had faced down her fair share of danger, and she wasn't one to back down from a fight. I won't sugarcoat it, Sackhell. The commissioner continued. This is going to be the toughest battle we've ever fought. The city needs you, and I trust you. I know you have what it takes to bring down the Scarlet Dragon. You understand their methods and their psychosis better than anyone else. Satchel nodded, her jaw set and determination blazing in her eyes. She had been studying the Scarlet Dragon for years, analyzing every move and delving deep into their twisted minds. She knew their patterns, their weaknesses, and their deepest fears. I won't let them destroy our city, Commissioner. She said, her voice steady. I won't let them win. Marshall Hall's eyes sparkled with a glimmer of hope at her words. He knew that Satchel's resolve was unwavering, and there was no one he trusted more to take on this dangerous task. The commissioner leaned forward, placing a hand on her shoulder. Remember, Sackhell, you're not alone. He said, his voice filled with a quiet intensity. I've assembled a team of elite officers to assist you. They'll have your back every step of the way. Satchel smiled, her gaze meeting the commissioners with steely determination. Thank you, Commissioner. I won't let you down. I'll dismantle the Scarlet Dragon, piece by piece, until they're nothing more than a distant memory. With those words, Satchel stood up, her hazel eyes burning bright with a defiant fire. She walked towards the door, her steps filled with a newfound purpose. As she turned the handle, she cast one last determined smile at the commissioner. Watch me. She said, her voice filled with a strength that made the darkness quiver. Watch me, commissioner. Boston will be safe once more. As the door closed behind her, the darkness seemed to retreat, and a feeling of hope stirred in Marshall Hall's chest. The Scarlet Dragon had awakened a sleeping giant in Satchel Drummond, a detective who knew no fear and would go to any lengths to bring justice to their city. And so, as the rain continued to pour, the stage was set for a battle of epic proportions. Satchel Drummond stepped out into the night, ready to face the dragon. The city held its breath, eager to follow her journey and witness the downfall of the Scarlet Dragon Crime Syndicate. You've been listening to The Dragon's Wrath, Chapter 1, The Resurgence, The Satchel Drummond Detective Mysteries. For more in this continuing series, log in right here on Spotify and participating outlets on the web or visit us at www.clubhousepodcastradiotoday.com.
For purchases of our audiobooks, you can visit our website store at www.clubhousebookacademy.store. The Satchel Drummond Detective Mysteries is sponsored by Club Stuff Shop on Etsy. My name is Olivia. Thank you for stopping in.